Greetings. This is Ceramic Pro Ural and Vitaly Baranov. Today, we'll go through the coating process of Crownline CR270 boat with protective solution Ceramic Pro Marine. We will also need pretty much all Ceramic Pro products to complete this task. So let's begin. The first step, of course, would be thorough cleaning of the boat's hull. Next, we begin the polishing process. Let's use this common Makita polishing machine. It's the best friend of almost any detailer. Also, we will need a wool pad that usually comes with the machine but is rarely used and often ends up forgotten in a far corner of the workshop. But this time, it will be a perfect tool for the gel coat polishing. Let's add some abrasive paste and start working. Apply the abrasive paste on the wool pad and get down to polishing of the gel coat. Keep in mind that it is very difficult to damage the gel coat by polishing, so don't hold back and put your muscle in it. Now the polishing of the hull is complete. Note that we polished it in one go. Also, don't worry about some micro imperfections that were not corrected during the polishing. Later on, Ceramic Pro Marine will fill the dents with a thick ceramic layer and these imperfections will not matter in the end. What matters is degreasing. That must be done after polishing. For this task, we recommend using Ceramic Pro Cleaner. After degreasing the hull of the boat with Ceramic Pro Cleaner, we are applying Ceramic Pro Nano Polish. It features additional degreasing properties and acts as a substrate for Ceramic Pro coatings. Let's start by applying Ceramic Pro Marine. We are using syringes to measure the amount of the product and its consumption more precisely. At first, we will be working with the surface below the waterline. Ceramic Pro Marine will be applied in two layers to achieve the maximum thickness of the protective coating. Add some Ceramic Pro Marine on the applicator and start applying the first thin layer in a long continuous line. The motions must be done in the same direction. Every line must slightly overlap the previous one. They must be straight and parallel each with other. Do not apply the coating like this or like that. Such technique is not fit for this task. Only apply in straight, long, parallel lines slightly overlapping. We have finished applying the first thin layer of Ceramic Pro Marine. Now we need to wait for one and a half to three hours depending on the temperature and humidity in the room. This first layer needs to partially crystallize, but you don't want it to become completely solid. So it's a matter of choosing the right moment to start applying the second thick layer. Applying the second layer of Ceramic Pro Marine below the waterline, add a large amount of the product on the applicator and apply in thick lines you will achieve a thick Ceramic Pro Marine Protective Coating. You will see some orange peel effect and roughness from the applicator, but the surface below the waterline doesn't need to look good as much as it needs maximum protection. And now we are about to begin applying Ceramic Pro Marine on the surfaces above the waterline. 
This process requires skill and does not allow mistakes. Let me tell you why. Ceramic Pro Marine must be applied only by a professional installer as it is easy to make mistakes that will result in cosmetic imperfections of the coating that will be very difficult to remove in the future. Within the first few hours, the imperfections can be removed by a microfiber cloth and solvent. After 12 hours, you will need P20 sanding paper and after 48 hours, it will be almost impossible to remove so you need to look out for the consequences. Let's get down to the application. Add a large amount of the protective solution on the applicator and apply on the surface of the gel coat in a thick, even layer. Use straight, parallel motions. Overlap the previous layer a bit. The more continuous and steadier your coating lines are, the better the result will be. We will also use Ceramic Pro Marine to protect chrome and metal pieces on the hull of the boat. We apply Ceramic Pro Marine and coat everything in one steady motion, applying a thin ceramic layer. We can see some roughness left by the applicator on the surface of the gel coat right after application. That's okay. Within the next three days, Ceramic Pro will even out on the surface. The deck and the cabin require protection just as much as the hull does. Now we will proceed with the coating of leather elements. We are using Ceramic Pro Cleaner to prepare the surfaces. To protect leather elements, we will use Ceramic Pro Leather. Apply generously on the applicator and coat with crosshatch motions, and once again like that. Wipe with a microfiber towel after two to three minutes. You could also use a spray gun to coat leather elements. This method is more effective, but it also requires more skill and one should complete a special training. The cosmetic effect is important for the coating of surface parts of the boat. We will be using Ceramic Pro 9H for this task. It will be applied in two layers, the base layer and the finish layer.
The rib surface where people are supposed to walk is coated only under the customer's consent as it might become slightly slippery. We will coat it with a layer of Ceramic Pro 9H to make it easy to wash. The cabin of this boat will be coated as well. All the leather elements will be treated with Ceramic Pro leather. Wooden elements and the tabletop will be coated with Ceramic Pro Strong. Ceramic Pro Textile will be used for the upholstery and other textile elements. The treatment of Crown Line CR270 boat is now complete. We have coated it with a thick, protective layer of Ceramic Pro Marine. What do we have in result? Bright gloss, increased resistance to scratches of the gel coat, protection from dirt etching, and easy to clean effect. Also, the boat is now protected from marine growth, which is a certified effect of the coating. This means that if any growth even happens, it will be easily removed with a simple rag. Finally, we can take a look at the result of the work with our own eyes. If you want to treat your boat or yacht, only go to professionals. Ceramic Pro products require skill to work with, but at the same time, they provide the maximum protection. When the job is complete, don't forget to offer your clients Ceramic Pro Cleaner and Ceramic Pro Sport. Ceramic Pro Cleaner is capable of cleaning almost any surface, including leather elements, gel coat, and glass. Ceramic Pro Sport is used for restoration of Ceramic Pro coatings. It can also be used on leather, gel coat, and glass as well. If you have questions or inquiries, please contact a Ceramic Pro Center in your region. Sign up to our accounts in Instagram, Facebook, and our channel in YouTube. Stay tuned for more. <music>